How's it going, good people? My name's Pedro, and is it just me? Or do these days you see more and more things labeled with gaming on it and find that they end up selling a lot better? I mean, you have gaming RAM, gaming memory, heck, even gaming energy drinks, all the while really not offering anything that is different from their non-gaming counterparts. Then you also have things that really shouldn't have a gaming tag at all on it. Things like a gaming router, for example, which claims to offer you better performance in your games while offering a better internet connection and faster speeds. So today we're gonna go ahead and have a look at these aftermarket routers, understand whether or not you should pick one up or if it's just an overpriced robotic spider sitting there waiting to claw off your face while you go to bed. This is the Unified Dream Machine, or UDM for short, an aftermarket router designed to replace the provided router from your ISP. This is a built-in router switch and access point meaning that you're able to basically plug this one device in and have all of your home network needs sorted right out of the gate. So there are a couple of good things when it comes to the UDM. To start off with, there are a lot of security protocols that are built into the UDM that you really can't find and really don't have access to on your built-in modem router combo from your ISP. On top of that as well, this thing also has the ability to scale up and scale down as your needs change. This is due to the SDN network architecture that it's using. This means that you're basically allowed to connect multiple devices that are all controlled by a centralized controller or a centralized piece of software. Now, if you compare on a software point of view, what you get from Unify versus what's provided by your modem router combo, it is a night and day difference. The Unify system is very clean, very minimal. It has dark mode and has many, many usable configurations that are simple to use, intuitive in design, and it's just fantastic to be able to interface with. On top of that as well, they have a fantastic mobile app that makes setting up your network relatively easy. Mind you, I had a bit of trouble setting mine up, but that was more user error than anything else. Now, if we look at a couple of comparisons in terms of actual testing between the Unified Dream Machine and the provided network router from my ISP. I personally have a 100 by 40 connection. That means I get 100 megabits down and 40 megabits up. Now, if we run these tests, the speeds are pretty much identical. You will see a minor difference run to run, but all within margin of error. And ultimately, the speed tests show that they are exactly the same. The next test we'll have a look at is downloading a couple of games to see whether or not I can see a noticeable difference from something like Steam, which once again, the games download in quite literally the exact same time, down to the minute. Now this basically highlights the first problem with the Dream Machine. Changing your modem router doesn't really seem to increase the speed at all, which is kind of crazy if you think about it, considering that this thing costs more than four or 500 Australian dollars. On top of that as well, when you compare the UDM to a device that is free, that is giving you the exact same speeds, it becomes a bit more of a harder sell from Unify's perspective. So by now, you're probably wondering, why should you even pick up a UDM? If your provided ISP router can do the exact same thing, is there really a need of getting a $500 aftermarket router combo that won't make a difference to my network at all? And to that, I say, if speed is your only concern, then probably not. But you know, I said those security features before, those are pretty much non-existent on the provided modem router from my ISP. Sure, there's probably some element of security baked into it somewhere, but nothing to the level that you can find on Unify and nothing to the level that you can configure and have alerts set up and be able to find out malicious activity being alerted straight to your smartphone. It is really a night and day comparison between what we see on the Unify system versus what we see on my provided modem router. The flexibility of the home network provided by the SDN architecture is fantastic because down the track, if I wanna update my home network setup and include a NAS to store all this footage that I'm recording on this camera, or if I wanna basically get rid of my computer up here and move it all upstairs into the one room and have a simple server rack to have all of my systems in, can basically do all of that with ease and the unified dream machine will just know what all of my devices are be able to prioritize my computer over anything else all of this is made super simple and is fundamentally fantastic when you look at it in comparison to the old ways of doing networking it is all really really easy to get into as an end user and really really powerful and puts all of that power basically at your fingertips but that's been it for me guys I personally think the Dream Machine is a fantastic kit 
and I'm planning on keeping it and planning on actually using it in my home network. Either way, guys, my name's been Pedro, and I hope you all have a good one.